My laboratory is interested in studying the role of the innate immune system in the development of metabolic liver diseases. We focus um, primarily on alcohol-associated liver disease as well as non-alcohol-associated liver disease. These are both um, growing clinical problems in the United States um, with alcohol because more and more people are um, consuming alcohol, but then also non-alcohol-associated liver disease is a growing problem because of rising rates of obesity. While we're a basic science laboratory, we have a lot of translational and clinical interactions. Um, the clinic is a great place um, for that sort of activity because we're very close contact with clinicians, particularly with liver diseases like alcoholic and non-alcoholic liver disease. There are a lot of what we call networks that are um, basically bringing people together across the country, both basic scientists and clinical um, investigators to test drug interventions, um, to try to develop biomarkers for disease progression or recovery from disease. We use cells and animals as well as people, but more and more we're using really um, state-of-the-art technology as well as bioinformatics. So a lot of the postdocs and graduate students coming into my lab are very much interested in using big data sets and we've had great success with um, basically mining those data sets to come up with new hypotheses that we can then test in our systems. I think what attracts the students most is the fact that they have this both a basic and a clinical component. So every student gets to um, trail clinic clinicians um, for 30 hours and then there's a clinical person on their committee. And from my group, because they study liver disease, it's exciting. Some, one student saw a liver transplant actually take place. He was able to observe. But then they also work with the anatomic pathologist who make the diagnosis for liver disease. So I think there's a real um, ability to, how can you say, see the human faces of the disease that you're studying. And I think that's, in a large part, what attracts students to the program. But then, of course, the clinic has fabulous uh, facilities for doing basic research. So that combination really makes it unique.